responsive reading first, and we're going to do our prayer. And after responsive reading and prayer, we're going to have the youth to come up and do what they do. Amen. And then we're going to move forward in our services. So if you will, in your Bibles, find 1 John chapter 4. 1 John chapter 4. I greet y'all in the name and in the love of Jesus Christ this morning. Amen. Give an honor to everybody in their respectful place. And Merry Christmas, amen. 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 First John chapter four. It's kind of hidden back there. It's a little small book, but it's there and it's powerful. Amen. 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 First John chapter four. We begin with verse number one. And it says, Beloved, believe not every spirit, but try the spirits whether they are God, because many false prophets are going out into the world. Hereby you know that he is the Spirit of God. Every spirit that confesses that Jesus Christ is come in the flesh is of God. And every spirit that confesses not that Jesus Christ is come in the flesh is not of God. And this is that spirit of Antichrist. Wherefore you have heard that it should come, and even now already is it in the world. Ye are God, with children, and I have overcome them, because greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. They are of the world, therefore speak they of the world, and the world heareth them. We are of God, he that knoweth God heareth us, he that is not of God heareth not of us. Hereby know we the spirit of truth and the spirit of error. Beloved, let us love one another, for love is of God. And everyone that loveth is born of God and knoweth God. He that loveth not knoweth not God, for God is love. In this was manifested the love of God toward us, because that God sent his only begotten Son into the world that we might live through him. Here is love, not that we love God, but that he loved us and sent his Son to be the propitiation for our sins. Beloved, if God so loved, all, so loved us, we ought to love one another. No man has seen God at any time. If we love one another, God dwelleth in us, and his love is perfected in us. Hereby know that we dwell in him, and he in us, because he hath given us it of his spirit. And we have seen and do testify that the Father sent the Son to be the Savior of the world. Whosoever shall confess that Jesus is the Son of God, God dwelleth in him, and he in God. Verse 16 all together. And we have known and believed the love that God has to us. God is love, and he that dwelleth in love dwelleth in God, and God in him. Amen. 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 Do y'all have the love of Jesus? That's your name. Amen. Hallelujah. Do you have the love of Jesus in your heart? Amen. 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 So y'all speak. Amen. Love is an action word. Amen. Love causes you to do things sometimes that you don't even know why you did them or why you said them. God, just to say thank you, Lord. Lord, we thank you, Lord God, because you're such an awesome God. You're such a wonderful Father, God. Hallelujah, God. You're such a wonderful Father, God. Hallelujah, that you so loved us, God. That you gave your only begotten Son, God. Hallelujah, God. So we thank you, Lord God, for the ultimate sacrifice, God. 
for your love, God. So right now, God, we give you our thank you, Lord God. We give you our thank you, Lord God. We offer a sacrifice of praise on this morning, God. Hallelujah, God. We thank you, Lord God. Hallelujah, God. We thank you, Lord God, for a worship encounter, God. We thank you, Lord God, for a shift in the atmosphere, God. Hallelujah, God. We thank you, Lord God, for a shift in the atmosphere, God. Hallelujah, God. Hallelujah, God. For a shift in the atmosphere, God. Hallelujah, God. Hallelujah, God. For a shift in the atmosphere, God. Hallelujah, God. Touch your people. Your house on today, God. We bless your name. 